where is the battle pass this is the question we are all wondering and that's what i'm here to talk about with all of you guys today so welcome back into the channel with me stay and we got a lot to get into right now so as of yesterday i released a video regarding the battle pass and how it was said to be dropping as of march 12th there was a ton of leaks hinting the release on this specific date they were marking it as kind of like you know a really special date that a lot of this stuff was going to be pushed out and it's seriously what the majority of the apex legends was expected there's a ton of hype on Twitter yesterday everyone was excited and was getting ready for this release I got players on my friends account who were taking days off work to get ready to play the battle pass on this day and it didn't get released so EA hosted a live stream and basically they just danced around the entire stream dodging comments from people about where's the battle pass where's new information this and that this and that and they just kept avoiding it until they finally addressed it and said listen we're not releasing any new battle pass leak or information or dropping the battle pass today they will be releasing information soon especially regarding the new legend and the release date of the battle pass but as for that day yesterday they aren't releasing anything but on origin yesterday they released a photo for the new season one battle pass and this just doesn't make any sense they, they address this as being an accident oh they accidentally put this on the website and I call that absolute bullcrap they don't pump fake us and tease us with stuff like that by accident okay there's no way someone accidentally uploaded season one's battle pass image on accident okay so basically it says welcome to the wild frontier survive the arena meet the apex games latest legend octane wield new weapons and score unique loot the season one battle pass is here purchase it at the in-game store for 950 apex coins so this gave us a little bit of information all right we now know that the battle pass is going to be called well i think it's going to be called the wild frontier they got to be unique in some way you know what i mean they just can't copy uh, the, the battle pass name from fortnite so it's going to be called the wild frontier and then also it's going to cost us 950 apex coins now depending on where you guys are from it's going to cost you different prices candy here it's a bit more expensive but 950 apex coins that's not too bad that's fairly reasonable for a battle pass so we got some new news we got some new leaks and it's giving us a bit more confirmation as to actual details about the battle pass and not so much about the release date which is okay we're like they said they, they're going to be releasing it soon so i guess we just have to sit here tightly and uh, just prepare for the actual release now there's also been other leaks around town this is not the only thing flowing around because as of yesterday there was images from data miners released of all 10 new legends that are coming Coming to Apex Legends, right? And now I'm not talking just names. I'm not talking just abilities and all that stuff. Okay, I'm talking actual photos of what these legends look like, and it's got me super excited. I have them all here for you guys right now, and we're gonna flash them on screen, and we're gonna browse through all ten of these new legends. And you guys, let me know down in the comment section right now, okay? Well, after we take a look at all these guys, who is your favorite? Who's got you most hype for the future of Apex Legends? And I mean, just based on the looks of him, who might be your new main in the future, okay? So, let's get into this first legend, and his name goes by the name of Rampart. He looks like an absolute beast. He's got the gray neck tats, those crazy things going up. And overall, he just looks like a Rampart. It matches him, you know what I'm saying? He looks like a brute, a force to be reckoned with. That cigar in his mouth is going to spit you in the face if you get too close. And so, yeah, he just looks like a solid character and a force to be reckoned with. Now, what do I think? his abilities could be well i don't exactly know no one exactly knows his specific abilities just yet but he does look like he's going to be some beefier and stockier type of character i mean he's probably going to be bigger like gibraltar unless they fix the hitbox sizes in season one and actually shrink down the size of all characters but once again they also said that certain characters are going to have their advantages and disadvantages based on their abilities but i think he's going to be some sort of brute force type of character he's going to have some sort of rage type ability i would think so you know what i mean now we weren't just leaked with the base image of the legend we were also given a 3d version of the legend's image which is going to be what translates into the actual game itself the first image is probably going to be what's like on the little icon when you choose them in the menu but this next image right here which i'm going to show you guys is what he could look like in game this 3d image is really nice it's really cool that we were given this because now
now we get like you know a better look of what he'll actually look like in game and ultimately it's a little watered down and washed out and it will once again it's a 3d image but it's nice to have it all right so we're now going to move it on to this next legend and she goes by the name of rose this matches up perfectly with just how she looks in her icon image i think this suits her really well and the fact that her image matches so nicely up with her name it really does once again add confidence into me believing that these leaks are true and it's actually going to translate into the game so this is what she looks like what do i think her abilities are going to be to be honest she kind of gives me this piratey vibe she kind of gives me this thiefy type vibe so i'm not sure what her abilities are going to be maybe she'll be some form of stealth character but then again we already got wraith with her portal so we'll have to wait and see again but now moving on we got our 3d image and her hair looks a little drapey here once again it doesn't look exactly like it does in the icon image but it does look fairly similar and this is what she's going to look like in game so now we're going to move it on to our next legend over here and his name goes by talcum slash crypto he looks like a sleazy guy i'm not gonna lie he looks very mysterious very something okay and he looks to be of asian ethnicity so shout out to the asians okay i'm asian too and uh we got a little sword on his back maybe that's his final ability who knows some sort of sword action that would be kind of cool in apex legends because as of right now no legends have really an up close lethal type of ability now what are the rest of his types of abilities gonna be we don't know yet once again we have the images here but none of the actual true abilities leaked as of yet i'll make sure to get those out to you guys as soon as they drop but like i said he's got that little sword so maybe his the rest of his abilities and his passive ability could revolve around this uh, item on his back so now over here we got his in-game photo his 3d image and it really doesn't look like him to be honest he's got those little dreads i'm sure those will translate larger into game but he kind of looks light skin in the right photo with his hair or like some some type of like toupee type of little dread top hat thingy and then in the first one he's got long hair so this one doesn't look too similar but once again he goes by the name of talcum slash crypto it could be either one of these names now moving it on over here we have octane okay this next image is the official released image for octane this one is true this is exactly what he's going to look like so you guys can bank on this being in the game anytime soon once the season one battle pass releases i've already told you guys all about octane he's got his abilities his passive is going to be some sort of health regen type of ability and then his tactical ability is going to be a sort of speed boost that you can activate on instant and then his final ability is going to be some sort of jump pad now when we take it on over to his 3d image you guys are quickly going to notice that due to him being released so soon his 3d image is much more accurate and much more on point with its details because once again this is the final release product for octane so that's his 3d image that's his unreleased image and now we're going to move it on to the next legend who goes by the name of nomad now nomad seems to look like the most badass character out of all of them in this list and he's got some red tunic going on and then he's got some sort of skull mask on his face now he looks really mysterious he looks really deadly what are his abilities i'm not too sure but we're quickly gonna throw it on over to his 3d image and it looks just like it. he looks scary guys he really does i'm excited to try out nomad at some point when he drops now one thing i do quickly want to put out there is the fact that um these are all 10 legends that they have in store for apex legends what i'm assuming is that only two legends are going to be released each season that's not a lot of legends and if only two legends are released each season and each season is two to three months long guys you aren't going to be seeing some of these legends until way in the future so you guys are really going to have to sit tight i know i am leaking these images to you guys right now but just keep in mind you may not see them for an extremely long time so that's going to do it for nomad over here you guys saw his um his profile pic you guys saw his in-game image and now we're moving it on to this other mysterious looking legend and he goes by the name of Skunner. now as you guys can see Skunner rocks a white type of tunic on him it kind of reminds me of assassin's creed a little bit and then on his back he's also got that rifle actually you know what you guys could almost say that's a bathrobe it's pretty close you know what i'm saying but take your pick and then this weapon on his back though kind of assumes like it well it makes me assume his abilities a little bit but i don't want to jump to any conclusions and saying that he's going to have some weapon as a tactical or final ability because for right now you can only pick up weapons in this game i 
know we got our airstrikes with Bangalore and uh, Gibraltar but once again I'm not gonna say that he has a weapon ability because once again none of these abilities have even been released so we're gonna shoot it on over into his in-game image and he looks pretty similar here he's got the whole robe he's got the whole tunic thing and then he's got his head popping through so that's gonna do it for Scunner everybody and the next legend goes by the name of Jericho Jericho just by the looks of him looks like he's gonna have some type of bomb abilities I don't know why this is just me assuming because he just looks like a crazy type of character he seriously looks like someone who came straight out of the game of Borderlands and to be honest the whole theme of these pictures and like all these legends here really look like they're coming from Borderlands all of them got that vibe that look and especially the tattoos really add to it on a lot of these characters so um the bomb ability maybe he'll have it maybe he won't he kind of looks like someone with this big scavenger pack on his back so he's carrying something in there maybe some tnt's loaded up in there but uh that's gonna do it for jericho moving on to his 3d image though you guys can see they're putting an emphasis on that little oracle on his eye so maybe he'll have some sort of zooming or scoping abilities to find out targets maybe he'll be able to lock on to people with that thing who knows you know what i'm saying we're just making assumptions but next up up, this is going to lead us into our final two legends on the list and we have natalie slash watson up first and you guys have already heard of watson i've already made a video on her and what is said to be some of her new special abilities in this game now if you guys take a look at her right shoulder she has a thunderbolt and we know already that her powers are going to revolve around electricity so this is a good sign this goes to tell us that our previous leaks are going to be true now i have another little image for you guys right now and and these are the logos and indicators for Watson's abilities. Take a look at them right now. We got her passive ability, her tactical ability, and her final ability. Now, what do these images and these little logos mean? I'm not sure. This just gives us a little indication and allows us to assume what her final passive and tactical abilities could be. So that's going to do it for Watson. We're going to take a quick look at her 3D image now, and it matches up nicely. You guys can see that she's got that little compressed hood on still. So it's translating good. Good. everything's looking good guys i know yesterday's battle pass league video really let everyone down yesterday even though that's what leaks were suggesting that yesterday was going to be the big day for release but we do have these new leaks these new legends are all looking extremely promising and let me tell you guys right i am extremely excited because season one is right around the corner now so we're going to translate on over into our final legend of the day and he goes by or he or she goes by the name of Husaria or Pro profit all right we're not exactly sure but as you guys can see he's got some little bone looking staff right here with these little blades coming off of it he's got a, a warm nice little hat on he's got braids down the side of his head and i honestly have no clue what this guy's abilities could be he looks really mysterious really unknown and like i said we're just gonna make our assumptions here i'm just gonna judge him based on the way he looks and taking a look at his 3d image he's got even longer dreads in this photo so i'm kind of confused i'm not really too sure what's going on here with Hysteria or profit but that's gonna do it for all the information i have for you guys today so that's all the legends that's all the news i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please make sure you drop a like down below i caught you up to speed with everything going on in apex legends right now if you guys are new around here and this was your first video here on the channel at staycation please make sure you guys subscribe i do apex legends content twice a day i stream in the evenings and i do informative videos to keep you guys up to speed and up to date with everything going on in apex legend so once again drop a like subscribe all the other good stuff i'll see you guys in the next one tomorrow have a great day peace out